this video, I'm going to be discussing about Vimo and the setup and the different things that I've went through as far as setting up a Vimo account. So first off, when you go to Vimo.com, and I believe you can actually get it, like if you have an Android or iPhone, you can get it as an app too. I was going to sign an account, but this is actually what the Vimo um, page looks like when you're setting and creating an account. So you can either type in your first name, last name, email, phone number, password, and you got to agree, or you can set it up with Facebook. I personally just did the first name, last name, da 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 and then I signed up. So I'm going to go ahead and log in my information. One thing that I've dealt with with Vimo is that when I set up my Vimo account linked into my banking account, it, it's like a small percentage of sins that might come out of the account just to make sure that you're linked with the right banking account, if that makes sense. So like if you check your banking account and you see that, you know, like you have like cents going on, then that's just Vimo just verifying, making sure that you have an account correct. So here we are, you know, you can add a picture if you want to, and this is just uh, what it looks like as far as the female account is concerned. So don't have a picture on there. And the getting started list, even though I'm only on 40%, I'm still able to get the payments linked into my banking account. So for instance, you can add friends on your female account. Let's go to my name, and it just pretty much just takes it back and how long I've been a member, and either I can connect to Facebook or I don't have to. And the payment methods, <laughs> I linked up with the bank. Like I set my bank account and then the privacy you can set your privacy on either public so I believe everybody will see like the transactions as far as like what's been going on in your account I believe or you can do private like you you know to the sender and the person that's receiving it as far and the same as friends do like in sender and the person that's receiving it just the friends so the notifications you can notifications as far as like for instance when I transfer my Vimo account as far as uh, money is concerned when I transfer to my banking account, I receive an email letting me know like, hey, your deposit is made da, 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 and your funds will be available at this day. So you get verifications, you get even text, you know, your app. So all these are something that you definitely will get notified automatically. But these, like the text and the app, you can like remove it. Like you don't necessarily have to get like a text. So it lets you know like where your most recent activity is. So let's say if somebody was near my account, you'd be like, wait a minute, I don't live such and such. You know, somebody else is logged to my account or like, yeah, I didn't know Vimo was, was like that. So the places that you're currently logged in into Vimo, that is crazy. But that lets you know like who's been, you know, in your Vimo account and the, the devices and stuff you've been using. So let's go to the main page and so I can show you how to even transfer in the first place. And what I do is, for instance, if I had $30 and it would say like transfer and I will click on that. And then for instance, like just like a cash app, if you have like $50, but you want to just transfer $30 into your bank account, you're able to do that. You type in the $30 and then it'll say, you know, the funds will be available the next day. And then you'll get a notification email letting you know that you're getting the funds. So yeah, that's pretty much it. You know, and if you need help, you, you know, uh, you can easily go to the help. And then, for instance, I called Vimo just to make sure. Like, I was like, hey, why is there cents coming out of my bank account? But that's just letting, you know, like, hey, this is your bank. That's linked into the right account. So that means your funds are going to the correct bank account, if that means going to the right bank. But like I said before, I didn't really fill out all the checklists. I'm only on 40%. I think I just did my name, my bank account, and I believe that was it. That's why I'm pretty much on 40 You can feel like where it's like 100%, but for me, instance, I just kind of just kept it simple get it to my bank boom i'm done so yeah so again the vimo.com okay let me go ahead and log out there we go and me log out boom there it is 